Tiger Financial News Network. TFNN Headline News Update. And this is the market news today. This is Peter Bruno, the host of the Wall Street Money Hour. And today the market movies are Amgen, which is up 4.18%. Eli Lilly is up 4.15%. Uh, Catalent is up 3.69%. CK Technology is up 3.42%. American Tower is up 2.76%. The negative for today is DeVita, which is down 17.85%. Baxter International down 11.48%. Insulet down 8%. Dexcom down 7.5%. And Zimmer Biotechnology is down 6.6%. Uh, uh, in our program, the Wall Street Money Hour, we'll be looking at the charts of the most active stocks today to see what they look like based on our Bruno Oscillator uh, cycles. Uh, the S&P 500 is down 2.87. Uh, the NASDAQ is up 23.43. The Dow Jones Industrial Average is down 57.10. The FTSE was down 8.18. Uh, Nikkei was up 189 points overnight. Uh, the Hang Seng was up 228 points overnight. And the VIX was up 26 cents overnight. Uh, on our uh, Managing Money Radio program, uh, uh, the Wall Street Money Hour, we'll be talking about the various uh, markets. And uh, right now, the, the oil energy is... Is down a dollar eighty-eight to eighty-four oh nine, and uh, the uh, uh, Bitcoin is down seven hundred seventy-five dollars. Uh, gold is up ten dollars and ninety cents based on the GC, and the MES is at forty-three eighty-seven, or the S&P five hundred is at forty-three eighty-seven, and the Dow Jones Industrial Average basis, the YM, is down seventy-three points. In our program yesterday, we were talking about everyone looking for an October low, and we said we don't think so. Uh, we think uh, it still has to be tested, the, the lower levels, and, um, and that's what we're waiting for. And today's pullback, uh, I think, is identifying uh, a couple of days of pullback before uh, moving back up. Uh, and I think the S&P may have 50 points on the upside uh, to go. 